And as kids and adults get ready for what goes bump in the night, Halloween shops are looking to cash in on the frights. Um, that's the doctor, but I'm the nurse of doctor shots. I'm a vampire flapper. She's going to be a rag doll. With one day left to go, just about everyone knows what they're going to be for Halloween. I'm going to be a go-go dancer. Nine-year-old Daniela Smith is hoping to use her go-go costume again soon. My school is having a play, and we have to be um, people from the 60s, 70s, 80s, and I'm going to be from the 60s, so I have to dress in this outfit. And I was just thinking I could be this for Halloween, too. While the National Retail Federation expects Halloween Halloween sales to be down about a billion dollars this year. The spooky economy isn't scaring away every customer. Well, I spent 50 on my wife, probably about 30 on her, and now I'm probably going to spend about 50 or 60 on me too. So, <laughs> yeah, a couple of hundred dollars, but it's worth it to spend family time together. And that's good news for costume shop employees. Uh, this is my first year working here, but I've wanted to work at a Halloween store for years because this is my favorite holiday. Kendra Parker got this temporary job after being unemployed for almost a year. In fact, her last job was in this same location when it was a goodies clothing store. It was really strange coming back here and it looking like this. But when tomorrow comes along, the state of the economy will be the last thing on these kids' minds. I like getting candy. You ready to go trick-or-treating, huh? Mm -hmm. Get some candy, lots mm -hmm. of it, huh?